hello guys welcome to the second part of this video so we have finished setting up our account now the next thing we want to do is to publish our facebook on google play right so we have created our payment profile we have linked our bank accounts we have entered our tax information okay so the next thing to do is to add our facebook right so just click add your book they are going to ask you some question right so select options do you want to sell ebook do you want to sell audiobook do you want to create an auto narrated audiobook do you want to offer a preview on google books only all right so this is self-explanatory so you want to, what want to do is sell audiobook sell an ebook sorry all right if you want to sell audiobook it means you already have an audio version of your book on your system already created for you created by yourself maybe with an ai or a paid platform the third option is create an auto narrated audiobook so maybe you have some books already on your google play google can help you convert them into audiobooks without you doing it yourself so first of all let us upload the ebook then they'll ask us to select a book id we want to choose set google book id all right so they should assign an id for us for our book then i'll click on save and continue all right so in order to successfully publish your book on google play there are just certain things you need and i'm going to look, we're going to look at them right now first thing you need is your cover your book cover second thing you need is the epub version of your book all right the epub and then the word version of your book all right your book must be uploaded on the epub if you want to convert it to audio later using the google play auto narrated option right you must upload epub version to convert your book to epub all right there's a website you just need to use very easy convertio.co all right or you can just search for word to epub converter on google just search for word to epub converter on google and just choose convert you right just choose this option and you upload your word document it converts it for you into epub version okay so after having your epub version you need your word document version the reason for this is so you can copy out your title copy out your subtitle your author name so it will be easy for you to just copy and paste without making any mistake right so I'm going to go back to uh, Google Play now so that we can fill in the details of our book. So we want to put in our title. So I will copy the title, the confidence code for women. I will copy it. I will go back there and I will paste. Alright, so the kind of books that sell well here is fiction and trend. Fiction and trend. All right if you are very good with self-help self-help can also do well if you know how to model all right if you know how to model best-selling books then your self-help book can do well you can just model a particular best-selling book convert it to audio and upload on this platform all right that's what i also do okay so the next one is our subtitle so i'll get the subtitle all right this is a book for women I love writing about women personally i believe women buy buy books more than men this is my personal opinion right women love to read they love to read a lot so the next thing we're going to need is our description right you need your description so i'll copy out my description for my book and now we go ahead to paste it so leave the formatting the way it is don't delete all these spaces so your work doesn't look jam-packed when you are previewing it you might think this piece is too much but it's not just leave this piece as it is all right and so much more other oh, copies will be more confident you all right so we are done with that so this publisher that's why i said make sure chat gpt gives you a publishing name that you can use right don't change your book identifier just change only the publisher name don't change your book identifier right your language choose your language where your book was written in english choose the format 
where the book is written in, then the page count of the book, the page count of the book. So since we are uploading the EPUB version, let's open the EPUB version up and see the number of pages we have on the EPUB. That's the number we're going to put there. All right, you can just find the number here. You can see the number is 156. All right, one slash 156. So this is page one, this is page two, and so on and so forth. So this is page three, this is page four, page five, page six, etc, etc. All right. So the next thing we are going to do is to put in the page number 156, 156. All right. Don't change your book identifier. Just cancel it. Whenever you see this change book identifier, just click on cancel. Then the next thing to do for mature audience, choose no. This is a self-help book. So when they say for mature audience, they are trying to ask you if your book contains sexual content, excessive violence, or materials deemed inappropriate for children. Just choose no. Your release dates, publication dates, just leave them blank the way they are, right? This is just it's just a bibli bibliographic information. Or I just leave leave this. I don't I don't put any information here. I don't think that information is necessary. Then I'll click on save and continue. I'll choose save and continue. I'm taking it slow so that you don't miss any point at all. Right? I'm taking this as slow as possible. Right now, they're asking you to select the gene. Now, the gene you just want to select is UK and Australia. Just come to UK and Australia. All right. For this particular one, you won't find any particular niche that you can place your book on. I've gone through it. So, from experience, just choose UK and Australia. Then, let's look for a particular niche that fits into what our book is all about abnormal psychology, accident, and emergency, blah, blah, blah. So I'll just go through it and choose the one that fits my book. Parenting. Okay, you can add more. Adult literacy guides and hide and handbook. So let's just keep adding. So you just select the ones that fit into what your book is all about, okay? So you want to take your time to go through each of this, alright? It's not something you should rush, don't rush it. assertiveness, motivation, and self-esteem. So, you can keep adding more gene. Just add more as much as you can that are related to your book. Right? And then when you're done, click on save and continue. Alright, so the next thing I'm going to ask you now is for your author name. So, this is where you put in your author name. So, I'll come back here. Dr. Helen Green. I'll copy it out. I will go back to the platform and I will paste it. Leave the biography the way it is. Just leave it empty. Click on save and continue. Okay. A notice about your account. Once you have the book ready to publish, there will be a short delay while your account goes through a preliminary policy review. Okay, so this is just because the account was just created recently, right? So they need to go through the account, make sure that I'm not trying to um, use the black hat method, I'm not trying to scam, all right? So just allow this review to happen. Before that review will happen, we would have set up our book and just wait for it to go live. So don't add any series yet. Just click on continue. Then we'll put our price. That's the next thing. Do ask us how and how we want to price our book.
So when they say apply DRM, are you seeing the meaning? So DRM means people will not be able to download the file, right? They will not be able to download it or use it to copy your content. Copy and paste limit should be zero. Preview limit to be twenty percent. You can't go below this actually. You can't go lesser than twenty percent. So just leave it at twenty percent. Then, then you just click on save and continue. Now you upload your content. This way you upload the content of your book and the cover. So I'll go back to my work. I will copy both of them. Right. So. So just click on upload the file, right? And then you drag and drop the two, your cover and your EPUB version. Just drag and drop them and allow them to load. So we're going to give it some time to load, right? All right. So once it has done 100, 100%, you click on close. And you're going to see the two files here. So it's currently processing the cover. Uh, EPUB has been processed. Issues, no issues. First version display flowing, right? So when we're done, we click on continue. And then we we'll put our price. So I usually leave my self-help books 5.99, right? Also considering the the length of the EPUB version, all right, 152 pages in length is quite it's quite good then make sure you leave here as world worldwide right worldwide means all the countries all the countries can access your book there is no limit so long as they can speak english they can get your book and as long as they are using android device your book is available to anyone all right it's available to anyone so this will review all right as you can see everything is intact review and publish so that's what they said once you have a book ready to publish there will be a short delay while your account goes through a preliminary policy review all right so we are going to now click on publish and then we'll wait for our book to go live congratulations you have successfully added your book to google play and google books so i'll click on done all right so a notice about your account so the reason why we have to wait, we have to wait for three days for we to do this. All right. So once we have, once they have verified our account details, right, we can go ahead and start seeing our book. Okay. There will be a short delay. So we, they, they want to verify, they want to verify our account, our bank information, and our account in general. So if you go to book catalog now. You are going to see need action so just ignore this need action whenever you publish a book and you are sure there are there are no errors and you see this need action it's just because your account is still undergoing review the book is undergoing review and this doesn't take time less than one hour your book is live that's why i love google play right less than one hour your book is live all right so once it goes live if you come to home you will be seeing your book on this um on this place top titles and you see your book here right so that's all that there is to publishing your book this is a step-by-step -step method and i hope you have got some value if you have any question you can do well to hit me on my dm and i'll answer your question so like i said the niches i focus on on this on this platform are fiction books and trends right and also self-help book i don't publish school books here all right just fiction self-help and training these are the three niches i focus on all right so that will be the end of this video for today all right so without wasting time see you in my next video